Hey guys, how's everything going? I'm Jesser. Let's take a look at number 75 of Leech Code, Sword Cutters. We're given an array of end objects, colored red, white, and blue, sort them in place so that same colors are adjacent with the colors in order red, white, and blue. We use 0, 1, 2 to represent red, white, and blue. We are not supposed to use the library sort function for these problems. Mm, uh, okay. A rather follow up. We a rather straightforward solution is two pass algorithm using counting sort. First iterate array counting the number of zeros, ones and twos, then overwrite array with the total number of zeros, then ones and followed by twos. Well, this is just the solution, right? We count it. Say we we one pass we count them with one pass. We got two zeros, two ones, and two two. So we will rewrite the array. So we we would will leads to lead to it was two O N, right? Could you come up with a space? We use three variables to keep it at count. So one. Could you come up with a one pass algorithm using only constant space? First, we if we use any sort sort method, it will result in O N lock N. This kind of time complexity, right? So we cannot use that. What we will try to find something else. Let's say and analyze the example. Two zero two one one zero. Okay, so let's try to traverse through the array. When we meet zero, when we meet two, we are sure it is. It should be put to the rightmost place, right? So we are safe to, re I think, swap to with the last number, right? It's zero, so we swap it. Zero, zero, two, one, one, two. And then we meet zero, and it's the first, it's okay. The second one, zero. The previous one, zero, okay. And then we meet two again. And now the rightmost is already two, so we find the next uh, non two number, which is one. We replace it. Two, one, two, two. And uh, it's done. Hmm. So that leads us to the solution, I think. We traverse through the array and then just put them to the rightmost or leftmost if we meet, if we meet zero or two. If we meet one, we uh, skip them. The possible the problem is that when we uh, move zero to the left and uh, move two to the right, the rightmost or leftmost should be uh, ignored, right? It's already placed, so we need to keep track of the rightmost index, which is uh, which is i and j. When we set number to left, we set it to we update i to the next one and then replace it and then check it again. And uh, this will end when uh, the Travis index meets the rightmost number, right? Yeah, it's pretty straightforward, I think. Now, let's try to do that. Okay. Let's i be 0, which means uh, left most number index. Let j equals nums.nth rightmost index let k equals uh mm, let k equals uh okay equals zero yeah while k is uh smaller than the 
when we, k is valid, which is in the right mode within the rightmost index. Switch nums k case if if it's zero if it's zero we should swap it with uh, a leftmost index right now we met a problem that if the first number is zero and we should replace to place it to the zero right uh, if that's the case we should skip if not if if it is not we should put it there and then check it again right okay if k is bigger than i If k is equal than i, then we should move i break. In either case, if it is swapped or not, i should be plus one. To be, should be put. Uh, to, should be moved to the next one. And uh, if k is bigger than it, then we should. Like uh, like this like like this case k is zero, i here is two. We need to swap it, right? Yeah. So swap nums k nums i equals nums i nums k i think these kind of uh i think this works right let's try it in the console let's a equals one two a zero a a one equals a one a zero what will happen? A oh yeah, it's swapped. Okay, this works. So if it's bigger than I, we swap it, and then if we swap it, we will check it again, right? So we we don't uh, increment k. If it is not, we will we will keep it there. We keep it there, and then if it is equal to it, like uh, if we swapped this two, it will be like zero two. And now we need to check two again, right? Yay. If it is equal to it, we don't do anything, but we need to increment k. k plus equals one. Break. For case two, we do the same. Rightmost. Uh, if k is smaller than j, we will swap them. And if not, oh wait a minute. If uh oh uh no no no, it must be like that. So for for the k smaller than j, if it's two, we need to swap, but we don't move k. Oh yeah, it's the same. In the other case. It is it is J if it is already J if it is J we will check it again. Wait 
Um, if already J, we don't know what it is, right? We will check it again here. We check, it, we see zero or, oh yeah, if this, because it's two and the K equals J, and uh, in that case, we do nothing. We plus one and uh, the, the loop ended. So we are saved to minus one for J. For the other case, case one, for one, we don't move, right? We don't do anything. We just keep move to the next, move K to the next one and uh, break. This is the whole switch. And uh, I think it's done. Let's see the time complexity. Time. For each round, we will move one number to the right position. So it's actually O1, ON. Space, we use three variables, so it's O1. It's one pass. Pretty cool. I hope it pass. Uh, o. Num is not defined. Nums, nums, O. My bad. Time limit exceeded. Mm -hmm. For this case, for example, mm, we made a mistake, I think. Uh, oh, here is nums. Let's see. For for this for this case, we first. I zero J oh my bad. This is this is should be it. Okay, so then J switch number because it's two we should swap two with this uh, zero. Mm, okay. Mm, except it for this example. Let's try submit. Please, oh yay, it, accept, it is accepted, nice. We do it with one trial, one try, uh, with minor mistakes, but generally it is good enough. So we're done with this problem, hope it helps. The core of solving this problem is that we need to ad analyze uh, the, the example, I think, yeah, just, to, just to do it naively and uh, say if we meet number two, what we should we do? We should move it to the right, right? And then we find another two. We should move to the uh, a number right to the rightmost. So that leads us to keep track of the leftmost and the rightmost. And for each loop, uh, one number will be fixed. So this leads to O N. Cool. So that's all for this problem. Hope it helps. Thanks for watching. See hope see you next time. Bye bye.